Hey everyone, welcome to Atomic Darts. I'm your host, Matthew. On this channel, we take a look at darts, darts related materials and other items that your subscribers ask us to review. So why don't you become a subscriber right now and then you can ask us to review something and we'll try and get it reviewed. And if you're currently a subscriber, hey, thank you so much for being a subscriber. Please go ahead and like this video now. I am excited to be taking a look at the particular barrel that we're gonna be taking a look at today. But before we do that, I did wanna let you guys know, if you didn't know, I do live interviews pretty much weekly Tuesdays at 7 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. And then I filter in some other reviews or just commentary during the week, different times of day, typically mornings, but just wanna let you know that is available out there here on YouTube and on Facebook if you follow us at Atomic Darts on Facebook. The show is called Coffee and Darts because it's early in the morning and I'm not gonna drink beers. I'm gonna drink coffee and I'm gonna talk darts. We're gonna have a good time doing that. Let's get into the barrel of the day and I'm excited about this one. This is a barrel of a player that has just really hit the scene, especially this year of 2020. I'm just excited about him. I love watching him play. Dylan loves watching him play. If you don't know who Dylan is, that's my six-year-old and we love to play darts and watch darts. And so I am talking about Devin Peterson and I have his Trinidad barrel right here for us to take a look at. So let's go ahead and get this box open and get a close-up look of the Devin Peterson steel tip by Trinidad. Here's a close-up look at the Devin Peterson steel tip barrel by Trinidad. This is a 95% tungsten barrel. This is a 21.8 gram barrel. They also say it's a 50.8 millimeter in length and 6.2 millimeter in diameter. I know they don't give those numbers out, but it was readily available, so I went ahead and gave that out. But man, I'll tell you, pulling this out of the box, and there is a picture right there of what's in the box. But wow, I just, I felt more like a man as soon as I pulled these out, like definitely like an African warrior for sure. I mean, these things are awesome. And I love the muted silver, kind of like a gunmetal silver, but it's just muted. It's not shiny uh, along here in the barrel, like these sections, I mean, where their cuts are, they've allowed the shine to stick out from the tungsten. This is a cool looking, but I just, I really did. I felt like I was more of a man. Like I was like, I'm a man now with this. This is awesome and it's grippy, which is really cool. Here, your standard point here and it comes into the barrel here. It's got a little bit of a, a grip right here, some rings and they've got grip right into them. A little smooth point, kind of like a push point right there. And then you come in here and you've got rings with axile cuts and it's shark skin or fish scale grip. I mean, there's a ton of grip in there. Again, making for a good push point, or if you like something a little less, you're gonna get a good push point in there. These are serious darts, guys. These are really nice. And this back end, which seems to taper just a little bit, that is just shark skin again or fish scale grip, and there's a lot of grip in there. Then you get this Trinidad shaft and these nice Trinidad flights. But I'm telling you, this barrel is for real. It's a nice feeling barrel. And I just can't get over the fact that I literally, I was like, man, I'm a man now. I don't know, I've just never had that feel when I grabbed a set of darts. All right, let's take this over to the board and give these things a throw. All right, so I'm gonna give the Devin Petersons a run here. I gotta say, this is a really nice barrel. And again, it just feels like a substantial barrel. There's a, a lot of grip. I like this front little push point right here. There's not a whole lot of grip there and right at the front, which filters in for someone like myself that doesn't like a lot of grip. But if you like some grip and you grip further back on the barrel or even, wow, man, there's just grip in this thing. I like this. It just feels solid. Again, it is 95% tungsten and that could be part of why, you know, just this nice feeling of the barrel. I'm a huge Devin Peterson fan. Dylan is as well. I'm so excited to see how well he's been doing this year. He's been working with Wayne Martle. Wayne's been coaching him this year and it's been kind of the coaching has just been, hey, pound the 60, pound the 180s, go after it. And if you've watched him this year, it's been a joy to see him just come out and with some aggression. And I love this African warrior mentality and what he's bringing to the stage and the character that he is. Because if you hear him when he does get to the announcer's box, which he does occasionally, he's like this really nice, quiet type of guy. He's got some good comments and good things to say about things. But at the Aki, the dude's a serious player. And I'm excited to go ahead and throw this for you guys and give you this review. Again, these are from Trinidad Darts, 95% tungsten, and this is a 21.8 gram. Now, I didn't weigh these out, but that's what it says on the box. 
So let's go ahead and give these a throw. All right, went a little right there. I gotta say, there's grip. Whenever I have a barrel with grip, to the right, to the right, that's kind of where it goes. Let's see if I can correct that here. I gotta say, they feel really good. I like that, I don't know what the difference between a 90%, 95%, 80% tungsten, but I gotta tell you, these just feel more substantial. Hang with me, I'm gonna throw my flights and shafts on. All right, so I got my flights and shafts on, which happen to be the Condor Axe flights and shaft, which are made by Trinidad. So it all works together, same manufacturer. I like the feel of these. Still kicking a little right, you know, the flight comes out a little left, and that's because of the grip on this. Just for me, uh, when it comes off my finger, it kind of pulls, but I like these. All right, let's give them one last throw and I'll give you a final wrap up. Wow, that's about all I can say. I mean, man, these just feel like, this is a 90% tungsten barrel, this 95. You can tell the difference in that weighting. It's crazy how just that percentage change, you can feel it in the barrel for sure. This has got grip and grip and grip and grip. I'm gonna say it's, you know, on a scale of that like zero to five situation, I'm gonna put these at four, four and a half, maybe a little bit over that. I think that grip will wear down a little as you throw them, which in my opinion will make them more playable. So if you get a set of these, play with them for a little while, they're gonna wear down a little bit and be that much more playable. I think that four and a half is gonna wheel down a little, but all in all, seriously nice barrel. I'm not sure if Devin is actually playing this particular barrel yet, or because I think this is a new barrel by Trinidad for him, and maybe it is. And of course it's World Series, World Series. Like we're talking about baseball. It's World Championship time of year. So if you're watching this past when I did this video, anyway, it's the time of World Championships for World Championship 2021, but it's 2020. Anyway, nice barrel, great job Trinidad. Can't say you know anything really, really bad about it other than it's more grippy than I would personally like. I recommend that you get the Condor Axe flights to go with these. If you watch Devin, that's pretty much what he's playing, but slightly different shape of flight, but it is the Axe. Great looking barrel. Typically, I think of Trinidad as a soft tip company, but they do have a number of steel tip players that play their product, and they're putting out some really nice, cool stuff. Really cool design on this one. They've added some of the axile cuts that we've seen. They're becoming popular in barrels, but they kept with some of the traditional rings and that fish scale, shark skin type, really grippy, grippy, grippy grip. So all in all, not a bad barrel. All right guys, thanks for watching this review of the Trinidad Devin Peterson barrel. Again, 95% tungsten, a 21.8 gram barrel. I think it was like 50 millimeters and I don't remember, it was 6.2 something millimeters wide. So there's some measurements for you. Check these out pretty much anywhere a stockist of Trinidad, they're gonna be available there because again, Devin is crushing it on the PDC this year. All right guys, thanks again for watching. I'm your host, Matt. This has been Atomic Darts and I will see you on the next one. Oh,